So we're going to do our meditation now. So I'd like us to do this meditation focused on the layers of consciousness and setting our intention. So we begin by taking three deep breaths in through the nose. Hold and out through the mouth, nice and loud. In through the nose. And out through the mouth, nice and loud. And once more into the nose. And breathe out the stress of the week. Continue to breathe deeply and calmly. And now from the center of our hearts, we expand a light cord up through the top of our heads, to the sky, to the stars, up to the highest dimensions until we reach the highest frequency, the highest dimension of love, the source of love of this universe. Remain connected to the highest dimension of love the source and extend the light cords down through the stars, the sky, back down to the top of our heads and into our hearts. And allow that love energy to flow down through the top of your head, like a waterfall of energy flowing through your whole being, clearing, healing, energizing every aspect of us. And now from the center of your heart, extend the light cord all the way down through the roots of your spine, going deeper and deeper through the layers of the planet, all the way down until it reach the very core, the very center of Mother Earth. And there connect into her crystal heart, to Mother Gaia's crystal heart. We send her so much love at this time Remain connected to Mother Earth's heart and extend our light cords up through the layers of the planet, through the roots of our spines and into our hearts. And now around each of us individually, we create a golden bubble of light with a source of love above and Gaia's energy below combined with our own. And as we encircle ourselves, encase ourselves in this golden bubble of light, we set the intention that only energies and entities with our permission, highest good love and compassion can see us or access us or exist within us. And that all other energies and entities must leave immediately. And into our golden bubbles, we invite in our angels, Archangel Michael for protection and clearing, and Archangel Raphael for healing, and our guides and our higher selves. And now around this whole planet, around planet Earth, we create a golden bubble of light together And we set the intention that only energies and entities that have the permission of the living things on this planet have permission to be in this space. And as we look at the planets with our hearts and with our eyes, we see the heart beat of every living thing. Everything is living. even if they do not have a heart in the way that we imagine. Even mountains, seas, oceans, trees, we are all living. This whole planet is living. And within every living thing, there is consciousness. 
And first we acknowledge each layer of consciousness within each of us individually. Starting with the lowest level of consciousness, the unconscious, the thoughts and the feelings and actions of what we do each day, including our unintended consequences around our reality, around what we do. including many aspects of how we create each day with our thoughts and feelings and yet we're unaware of the effect that we have as our unconscious. Stepping up to acknowledge our subconscious, the ability to program ourselves and to be programmed, to allow our body functions to run our heartbeat every aspect of this human form to run automatically and for us to program ourselves such as how to drive a car, an automobile without consciously thinking all the time only stepping into consciousness when we need it and being aware of the times we are programmed through media, through advertising through social norms and conditioning These are built also into our subconscious programming. Up into our conscious, day-to-day consciousness. Like the consciousness that brought us to this interaction, connecting at this time in this meditation. The coffee that I made before this session the enjoyment I have of my daily routine and all the decisions I make throughout the day and becoming aware now of our highest, higher consciousness the highest aspect of ourselves individually the highest version of ourselves sometimes called our higher self and this is the highest most ascended version of our own consciousness, our highest creativity, our highest love, our highest thoughts, our ability to rise above the day-to-day challenges that we have and see the beauty and simplicity of this universe. Coming up now to the collective consciousness, which also has many layers, But with the collective consciousness, we become part of something bigger. Like when we're all excited about the new year coming. There's a wave of collective consciousness and emotion across this planet. We're all excited together about the new opportunities that the year will bring. And just as we can hold excitement and love and joy in the collective consciousness together. There are also negative emotions of fear, of the economy, of war, of safety, of suffering. We hold space for all of this. And coming up now to unity consciousness, where we are all, all one, we're all one in our unity. And at this level, we realize that we are all parts of the same source of love. We're all unique expressions individually of this beautiful, divine light of this universe. Every aspect from darkness to light, from those that live in darkness to light and everything in between, And for the darkness and light within us, all of this exists within unity consciousness. And all of us connect into it, whether we are conscious or not. And in unity consciousness, we find that we are never alone. That we are always together. That our love is shared, our fear is shared. 
darkness or light and everything in between. And much of our purpose in our incarnations in our lifetimes are to live out unique expressions of individual consciousness. And yet, we are still always connected into unity consciousness. We never truly leave, even though we are unique expressions and individuals in our hearts. And so our meditation today is to send in love to every layer of this consciousness and how it affects every part of our day-to-day -day lives from our breaths within our breaths, our heartbeats within our heartbeats, our thoughts within our thoughts, our actions within our actions, within and around everything. And so now from the highest dimension of love and source above, I bring down this column of light to above planet Earth, connecting in with every living thing, spanning out into light beams into every living thing, the heart of everything that is living. And we start now sending love into the unconscious aspects of us, what we're unaware we're thinking or doing, moving up now to the subconscious, releasing any programming that no longer serves our highest good, releasing programming that constrains our creativity, allowing it to fade away, allowing us to call on our consciousness when we need to make decisions and not just to go forward into decisions blindly. Coming up now to our day-to-day -day consciousness, sending in love and calm, trusting that we always have enough time in our daily lives for everything that is important to be done in that day. Everything else can wait. Coming up now to higher consciousness, to encourage us to call on our higher consciousness whenever we need it including in our day-to-day -day mundane tasks which route to take when we're driving which bill to pay next which thing to buy next coming up to the collective consciousness being aware of how that feels when thoughts and feelings are not ours they are the collective us and so being able to discern and see the difference between yours and the collective and holding space for the collective, understanding that we are all part of the collective also. Coming up now to the unity consciousness, seeing that wrapped around all of these layers of consciousness are this beautiful aspect of oneness. That every layer is one, every living thing is one. Whenever we need something, whenever we need help, whenever we feel lonely, whenever we feel lost, remember we are all part of the same oneness. Sending in this love, this unconditional love to every living thing. And I would like to leave this healing and this protection in place. As we bring this meditation to an end, I would like to thank our guides, our higher selves, our angels, the source of love, Mother Earth, and every soul that's participated to everyone in the live chat and within the replay. And so it is. Thank you so much for joining in this live stream. And I look forward to sharing more with you each day. 
um, please do check out my page where I'll be posting a new song every day, including today's song and also this meditation. And I look forward to speaking to you soon. Thank you. Sending my love from Scotland. Love you.